Here's some expected results for the parallel resistor measurement. Before I look at the circuit with the parallel resistors, let me begin by measuring the individual resistors. Let me check the ohmmeter. I'm shorting the DMM probes together, although it certainly helps if you run the ohmmeter, so let me go ahead and do that. So I hold the probes together and we want to see the resistance ideally showing up as zero, but as long as it's very small, we're in good shape. Here I'm measuring R1. Looks like we've got 9.91K. Here's R2. And here we have R3. I'm going to try that R3 measurement one more time. Okay, 32.5K. That sounds good. All right, I've connected the resistors to form the uh, two parallel circuits, so I can test the equivalent resistance of the first parallel combination. Looks like 7.61 kilo ohms, and the equivalent resistance of the second parallel circuit is 5.76K.